Unfazed by the massive protests and collective international criticism it has been facing since the custodial death of 22-year-old Masa Amini in September last year, Iran has further handed down three more death sentences. The latest sentences for three men convicted of killing three members of the security forces brings the number to 17, the official total of detainees condemned to death in connection with nearly four months of protests. In the latest ruling, the three Iranian men have been sentenced to death for waging war against God, though under Iran's Islamic Sharia law, the men can still appeal the verdict. At least four people have been hung since the massive wave of demonstrations took over Iran last year. According to the judiciary, the number of hanged protesters has reached a total figure of four, and it includes two protesters for allegedly killing a member of the Basij paramilitary. Now, according to reports so far, at least 519 protesters and 68 security personnel have been killed in the unrest. The Iranian authorities claim the numbers to be in hundreds, including members of the security forces. The protests have turned out to be one of the boldest challenges to the clerical leadership since the 1979 Islamic Revolution. The protests have drawn support from Iranians in all walks of life and challenged the Islamic Republic's legitimacy by calling for the downfall of its rulers. Now, according to his official website, Supreme Leader Ayatollah Ali Khamenei has called these protests an act of treason and further warned that the responsible institutions will deal with treason seriously and justly. German Foreign Minister Annalena Baerbock has condemned Iran's latest ex execution of protesters, calling it a regime that murders its own youth to intimidate its population. And that it has no future. Baerbock summoned the Iranian ambassador to the foreign ministry. The French, Danish and Norwegian foreign ministries have also summoned Tehran's ambassadors. The regime has blamed Western governments for the unrest and has responded to the protests with a bloody crackdown that has left over 500 dead and hundreds of others injured. Weon is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.